Okay, so I came into this QT to use the restroom and you know, you had the woman talking about, oh, she got mental hygiene and you see these people purposely leaving me outside and they removed my channel with all my videos of how I look when I got somewhere to stay. Um, and they tried to arrest me for going in Perimeter Mall and changing my outfit. Um, and I had some women, they follow me everywhere I go. They follow me to the restroom. I had to come to QT because it's 24 hours. I worked on some evidence at Avondale Station where I could plug up my phone because they're not allowing me to plug my phone anywhere. So when I came into the restroom, um, there was some white women that came to the door after I came in and you could hear them talking outside the door. And I was sitting here taking a shit on the toilet. And I was like, you know what? Um, I don't walk miles to get here to use this restroom. And I know they being wicked. Um, I was like, I'm going to finish using the restroom and I'm not going to allow these women to intimidate me uh, from using the restroom. Like I got to rush. So I'm a shit and I'm going to wipe my behind. And when I'm finished, she can use the restroom. And all of a sudden I get up to wash my hands and boom, boom, boom. I'm like, who is it? He's like maintenance. And that's what they went and did the last time when I was in the restroom at Perimeter Mall. Somebody went and got security and main clean up people on me and I was changing my outfit But this time I was taking the shit and I was like see If I would have decided to come here to actually change my clothes or do something You see they got it set up for people to harass me when I'm in the restroom And I was not I'm not about to do that because I don't care about nobody trying to make me look bad I came in here just to use the restroom and I should not have no one harassing me at the door when I was not even in here five or 10 minutes. I just took a shit. And then as soon as I got up to wash my hands, this white man is over here knocking on the fucking door talking about some maintenance. And I was like, you know, let me just go ahead and, and film uh, what they doing. So anybody try to say I'm dirty or whatever they want to say about me, I don't give a fuck because you know, I'm gonna I'm a take a shit in peace. Now they could try to make it seem like I'm an outcast from Egypt and they could try to make it seem like they don't want me in their society. But like I said, when I'm on the toilet somewhere, leave me the hell alone. Leave me the hell alone. I'm, I'm just keeping it real. And uh, it's so sad because